Good morning, everybody. Day 194, I think. <laughs> I don't even know anymore. But I know... You hear the road noise? That's Dick's Creek Gap. I just left out of there. Katie and PR dropped me off. And today we're going to Unicoi Gap. It's almost 17 miles. And then I don't know where we're going to go tonight. We might go back to Ghost's house. Man, I'll tell you what. Ghost, thank you so much for like letting us come into your house and using it as our own. It was perfect. And not only that, the great conversation. Always great seeing you, Ghost. And thank you for everything. I appreciate it for sure. Um, and so, yeah, we stayed there last night. I might actually go back there tonight from Unicoi. Depends on, like, how long this 17 miles is going to take me. We got a lot of climbing today. We got, yeah, a lot of climbing. But, should be a beautiful day. I'm not calling for any rain, which is even better. And I'm just going to mosey. Even if I do two miles an hour, I mean, I'll be there by 5 o'clock. Because, yes, it's... Nine o'clock in the morning. A little late start, but whatever you have those some days. <laughs> I couldn't stop drinking coffee at Ghost's house. It's perfect. Yeah, I guess I'm done rambling this morning. And I hope you guys have a great great day and i'll touch back with the cool stuff and the views you know just like i do baby let's go get some climbing done today in my opinion this might be one of the hardest sections in georgia i think Unicoi to Dix Creek. It's hard at northbound. <laughs> All right, I'm done rambling. I'm gonna zoom you in. Boop. Nice little view. And it's a really short side trail to this view. And there's some good camping up on the side trail too. Whew. I'm sweaty. <laughs> that climb up here was steady for a while mm. but it feels good to have the first little up out of the way now we're just gonna ride this ridge for a little while well you know the routine up down up down up down all day long Whoo! <laughs> yeah. Mm. Top of Kelly Knob. <sighs> zoom in. <sighs> Clouds are covering up the bigger mountains. <sighs> okay. So first big climb of the day is over with now we're going to drop off kelly knob we're going to ride this ridge for a little while and we're going to go up trey mountain down trey mountain to indian grave gap 
up Rocky Mountain down to Unicoi. Ah, that's the dilio. <laughs> All right, Addis Gap. Look at this. Hard to read. It says Trey Mountain Wilderness, <laughs> but it is really hard to read. Top of round top, I guess. And I wonder how long it took somebody to carve that in there. <laughs> it really looks like it was done by hand. And maybe a drill. Maybe they had a concrete bit with a cordless drill. They could have. I don't really know. I guess that's the way I'd go about it if I was going to do something like that. This is our roller coaster today. <laughs> and we're gonna go down, yeah, you know the routine. And it's not even the top of round top. I mean, that's the top. See, that's why I don't get the AT. Why didn't they just take us right over the top of that thing? I mean, we're so close. Might as well just finish it out. Oh. <laughs> All right, downhill to catch my breath, uphill to lose it. Swag of the Blue Ridge. <laughs> I like that sign for some reason. That and the Chunky Gal Trail sign, <laughs> I like that too. So funny. Trey Mountain. Ooh, there's a campsite right here. Pretty nice one, actually. Yeah, it's real nice. We're gonna drop our final little down and then boom, up Trey. Look at this tree. It's like So crazy. Oh, what please? <laughs> These rocks are cool. They're massive. Super big. Ooh. Yeah, we're climbing tray now. Ooh. <laughs> oh yeah. <clears throat> Getting it. Boop, 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 boop. What, please?
Alright. Top of Trey Mountain. Let me zoom you in. Boop. That almost looks like Yona Mountain. Not sure quite yet, but that was Betty Man. <laughs> I'd say that's what it is. <sighs> Top of Troy Mountain. Now we're going to drop down, go up Rocky Mountain, then down to Unicoi Gap. But Trey, Trey Mountain, kudos. All right, so we just left Troy Gap. And this is the view of Trey Mountain. That's what it says on Far Out anyways. Yeah, that's all you can see too, pretty much. It's Trey. There's a campsite right here, but... I guess I would trust that spot with the trees around me. Looks like they're gonna fall from where I would set up my tent the opposite way. But you never know which way they're gonna go. All right, 1.7 or 1 1.5 or 1. Point something to Indian Grave Gap. And then boom, boom. <laughs> I like this little ridge walk. If you leave Trey Gap, you're on this cool ridge. I like how the trail is lined with little moss. Super neat. <laughs> And we have been dropping fast for a while. Yeah, that climb up tray going northbound. I feel for you. <laughs> but trust me, it's not gonna be the worst one you have. And it's actually pretty gradual compared to some climbs, but it is it is a long one. I've been going down for a while. We're almost down. If I had to guess. I'm pretty sure it's mounting through the trees here. I think <laughs> that's our next climb. Indian Grave Gap, everybody. All kinds of cars over here. Must be a pretty decent road. And gets that black car in here anyways. Or that gray one, for that matter. Yeah, Indian Grave Gap. Now we're just gonna climb up to a rocky mountain and down to Unicoi. Final little up.
definitely Yona Mountain. For sure. And this is pretty much the top of Rocky Mountain. Stranger danger. All right. So, we're pretty much, that's the top of Rocky Mountain. And, uh, <laughs> like, there's a bunch of high school kids out here, which is kind of great, actually. I mean, the group size is pretty massive, but at least they're out here and they're not on their phones. It's always good. All right, now I'm going to start moving. Downhill is my favorite. Yeah, I love this downhill, actually. It's nice and chill. Oh, wait a unicoi. So that's the dealio. Made it over Rocky Mountain. At any moment now, we're gonna start dropping. <laughs> what's happening everybody end of the day recap day 194 we left dicks creek gap this morning at 69.2 miles and we're now sitting at unicoi gap at 52.5 miles makes it a 16.7 mile day everybody and uh we got down to unicoi gap skip james is there hanging out with katie uh waiting on for me to get down because he's bored because he just had knee surgery <laughs> And you need to get out of the house. So I'm a great excuse for it. It's perfect. Uh, thanks for coming out today, Skip. It was great seeing you again, as always. Um, and then Katie and I drove the HST mobile back into Hiawassee and uh, went to Michael's Steakhouse. They had a buffet there tonight, so we had a pretty good dinner. And then we drove back to Ghost's house. So that's where we're at. We did laundry. We've been hanging out for a few hours now, and then it looks like tomorrow morning we're going to bust out of here, drive back to Unicoi Gap, and I got a couple options, uh, which is good. I always like options. So tomorrow I can either go Tesna T Gap, get out there, sort of sleep there, and keep going the next day, or I can go all the way to Neil Gap, which is like 21 miles. It's supposed to be nice tomorrow, so... I kind of see Neil Gap being my destination, uh, but I'm not sure. We'll see how I feel when I get to Testament T Gap or Hogpen Gap. Either one of those gaps are so close to each other. That's where we'll make a decision either to go to Neil Gap or just call it a day there. But if I was a betting man, I'd be saying I'd be going to Neil Gap. And then we'll probably either sleep in the van somewhere around there or go to Blood Mountain Cabins. I'm not really positive. Um, We'll see. And then the next two days looks like rain um, to finish up. <laughs> Yay! But we'll play by ear, and I got till, well, I pretty much got till Saturday before I really have to be done. Friday, I'd 
I don't have to be done anytime. I'd rather have it all wrapped up by Thursday or Friday. Um, but we'll see. Anyways, I'm starting to ramble. Day 194, 16.7 miles. And I hope you guys had a great, great day. And I'll touch back with you guys in the morning, baby.